Wir haben die schwarze Festung verlassen. Wir sind jetzt Deserteure. Tja, sag noch mal Tschüss. There's no turning back now. We're deserters for sure. We're breaking our vows. I've taken plenty of oaths. Broken plenty too. Words don't mean shit. There'll be a price on our heads. The vows I said here, I meant them. I was a brother. But the Night's Watch betrayed me. Die haben That's on them. Hm. Schnell weg hier, schnell weg. They know we're gone now. Es gab hier nicht mal eine Anhörung tatsächlich, ne? Then how fast can you run? Besser ist das. Besser ist das. So, und so langsam merkt man schon, spitzt sich das alles zu. Oh, ich weiß nicht, ob das so gut ist. Und unseren Leuten geht es nicht gut. Nicht zu essen. Müssen alle da. Oh mein Gott, das ist so furchtbar. Es war besser, als ich dachte, oder nicht? Roderick! Da bist du! Lady Forrester! Was ist wrong, Mother? It's Griff. He was arguing with the Maester and things got out of hand. I'm coming. What do you mean to do? Th this could be our chance. He's right. We must hurry before things get violent. I want to try talking to him first, see if we can work this out. And if that fails? Just don't forget your promise, Roderick. The rest of my men are still in the grove. They could be here in minutes. I'll need every one of them for what I'm about to do. I'll have them here as soon as possible. Let's go. And Arthur. Listen for my signal. I'll strike my cane when I want you to enter. We'll be ready. Jetzt wird's interessant. Ich weiß nicht, ob die wozu die Entscheidungen jetzt führen. Ich habe keine Ahnung. I'm coming with you. It's not safe. You should wait for your brother. I don't care if it isn't safe. Griff thinks I belong to him. I need to show him I don't. Mm. Together then. Ich frage mich gerade, ob ich die Stelle hatte. Das kommt mir nicht bekannt vor, tatsächlich. Der Lord ist wieder da. Steht auf. Wir werden die Sache jetzt ein für alle Mal regeln. Ich hoffe, es geht gut aus. You'd have tried harder for a forester. My lord, please. I am the only lord who matters here. Roderick. Help me. Tell your dog to obey his new master. And while you're at it, Elena Glenmore, what are you doing with him? You're supposed to be marrying you? me. I'd rather marry a dead horse. You watch your bloody tongue. Or I'll give you what I'm giving the maester. Excuse me? What's going on here, Griff? He's disobedient. Just like you were, Roderick. <laughs> Before I brought you to heal. So now he's paying the price. Ah, and he brought the end of the ash. Don't believe you. <laughs> You're not the Lord here. And I'm tired of you pretending you are. You think I'm fucking pretending? You das hat Griff I... nicht gefallen. My brother is ready. I think you need another lesson in humility. Just like your maester here. You can watch if you like. Actually, I think it's your turn. 
I don't think so, Roderick. Missed. Missed. Oh, what's the cripple up to now, eh? Fancy yourself a warrior? You are nothing, Roderick. Just give up. Not today. Accept it. You're just embarrassing yourself. What are your orders? I'm the only one here who gives the orders. What are you waiting for? Help the master. Bist du die Waffen holen sollen? Ah, oh, das ist immer so schnell weg. What are you doing? Back away. Now. This is my hall. You have no right to be here. Das ist nicht deine Halle. Now then. About humility. Get your hands off me. My father. We'll go straight to Roost Bolton. Leave Iron Rat. Take your soldiers and get out. Then maybe I'll show you mercy. I'm not going anywhere. You gonna hurt me? Your friends won't be around forever, Roderick. And when they're gone, I will see that you pay for this. All of you! Ich bin jetzt mal vernünftig bei dem. Bei dem bin ich vernünftig What's wegen unserem Bruder. Be, I'm not like you, Griff. You're right. You are a fucking coward. Find the white hills to the cellars. No one gets in or out. Coward! Bloody coward! Ich wollte ihn erst anspucken, aber wir müssen an unseren Bruder denken. Oh, schade, dass ich das gerade hier... Na Mann, das ärgert mich so. Ich habe den Move völlig vergessen. Word cannot reach High Point. You must be sure of it. Not as long as they still hold Ryan. Kill the Ravens. All of them. I swear I will. Fuck you and your queen. That's enough. So long as you're in my camp, you will obey my orders. And getting pissed drunk before a mission. Obey? You know what kind of ship brain fool does that? One who wants to fucking die out there. Have you lost your damn mind? I am not some animal in a cage. What in the seven bloody hells? I'm glad to see you two are getting along. Warms the heart. I'm not the one with the problem. It's him. She can't fight like this, Asher. You think I'm too drunk to fight? What the fuck What do you, you gonna know? do? Run out there swinging a fucking... Ah! Ich finde die Synchros übrigens richtig gut. You fucking bitch! Oh, there we go. There's the asshole I remember. Ah! Ah, you could never handle a fair fight, could you? Deal with your friend! She'll get us all you killed. You sound scared, Croft. This is bloody important. You afraid your mother will spank you? Mind your own business, Croft. You don't need to worry about us. Just take care of this. Because if she can't hold it together, we're leaving without the both of you. <laughs> you think your little thumbcock can take Marine all by itself? <sighs> I'd never work with a bloody show like you. Auch wenn sie gerade scheiße ist, wollte ich sie einmal im Schutz nehmen, weil sie die ganze Zeit schon einen drauf gekriegt hat. Oh! Mann! Croft doesn't know shit about anything. None of you do. You can't let him get to you. You're better than that. It's not just him. You think I give two shits about what Croft has to say? Your fucking uncle is the only reason I'm even here. He told your little dragon queen I would go into Marine with you. You brought me here. I'm doing this for my family, Fisker. This is oh, the only it's way. always about you. Your family. Your problems. Come on, Asher. Hit me. Oh, if this was a real fight, he'd be dead. I'm not going to do that. Uh. 
So what? You're gonna kill me because you don't want to go into some fucking city. I was a slave. Here. In this fucking city. I was taken from my home when I was only three years old. When I was seven, my master threw me in the fighting pits to die. When my master tired of watching me kill animals for sport, he started... He started sending other children. I butchered every one of them. I... After a while, I thought the fear was gone. But you had no choice. I did. I decided my life was worth saving. But theirs were not. There was this boy. We used to play five stones in the alley when we couldn't sleep. When I saw him next, he was in that pit with me. I saw the fear in his eyes. That same fear I felt my first time. And I realized it hadn't left me. I still wanted to live. I wanted it so badly. My master watched as I did it, smiling. Here. Thank you, little brother. I bought my freedom a long time ago, but I have always hated this place. Hated him. Dezor Zoraza. Because of that man. Marine is a city of dead children. Don't worry about me. I won't let you down. I know you won't. Da, der wird schon gleich gut gehen mit den Getränken, aber boah. Krasse Geschichte halt, da kann man es jetzt natürlich nachvollziehen. <lacht> you shouldn't say that. <lacht> Why not? Boah, was für ein Helmut, ey. I'll meet you inside. Hä, warum guckt sie so böse? What are you doing here? I have to get in there, Sarah. I know I'm not supposed to attend. But then you know Lady Marjorie doesn't want to see you. What could be so important? Lord Whitehill is up to something. He's conspiring against my family. And someone in there is helping him. Lady Marjorie would be furious, Mira. I can't. I'm sorry. I want to help you, but I can't risk it. I'll take the blame. You can tell Marjorie I snuck in and you tried to stop me. She's already thinking about replacing you. Are you sure you want to risk it? I have to. <sighs> All right. You owe me for this. She's with me. Ja, aber jetzt kann man das doch nicht mehr sagen. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. Na ja. Die feine Gesellschaft in Königsmund. Feels so a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. Tommen is our king now. Long may he reign. Sarah. I was worried you'd run off with your friend. Helmut. And what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. This is Lady Mira Forrester. Mira. 
Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Where have you been hiding her? You're making her blush. Sorry, Nera. <laughs> you flatter me. Sarah's lovelier than us all. I won't argue there. It's quite a feast, isn't it? Just be careful around the wine. I hear you're partial to a particular arbor red. It's easy to forget. Nothing you do in King's Landing goes unnoticed. Drink too much once and you're forever the drunken fool. Talk to the wrong people oh, and... Oh, Lord Tarwick! What was that about? Nothing. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. <gasps> My ears are not delicate. Of course they are. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> Let alone. Stop it. <laughs> what? I mean it. Someone caught your eye, Mira? I'm sorry, I... I I'm, I'm rather thirsty. Oh, allow me. No, I can get it myself. Thank you. If you'll excuse me. This reminds me of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe that... You told me this story. But you would have loved it. We danced all evening, drank wine from our helmets. That and is it! And you're being Emma. ridiculous! Dieser wütende Mann. Warte. So. Sarah und Helmut. Nein, 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 ich wollte die belauschen. Nein! Nein! Oh Gott. Oh, I can't remember. I think it was a bird. Close. A cock. That's it. No. Ein bitte was? Terrible. You're the one telling the joke, remember? It is a lot, but I know how to spend it. Hmm. But how did you manage it? Lord Whitehill trusts me above all others. That's why I'm the only one he's willing to work with. Oh, an exclusive deal. Ah, okay. Oh, good for you, Andros. Well, I've got my family to consider. When's the last time you even saw your wife, Andros? Schön, Wein. Dann trinken wir mal ein bisschen Wein. Game of Thrones macht immer so Lust auf Wein tatsächlich. Jetzt so einen schönen, guten Rotwein. Ja, bei ihm kann ich nichts machen. Boah, die Stalkerin. Okay, weiter geht's. Mit den beiden mal sprechen. Sarah, Lord Tarwick. Well met, Lady Mira. I hope you're enjoying yourself. Have you had any luck? Luck? With what? This place is full of eligible men. I assumed you were on the lookout for a husband. That isn't really what Mira's interested in. Nonsense. You must have your eye on someone. Oh, don't press her, Garibald. I'm only curious. No harm in that. Tell me about yourself, Lord Tarwick. Oh, so meine ich das gar nicht, Sarah. So meine ich das gar nicht. Ich wollte nur nicht darauf antworten. Fought for the Sea Lord of Bravos. Lived in Volantis for a time. Even sailed to Slaver's Bay once. What was that like? Ja, nein! Sweaty. Ich wollte das nicht. Oh nein, ich wollte das nicht. Ich wollte nur nicht die Antworten. Permanent. Oh. I should be going. Stay out of trouble, Mira. Oh. Sarah, it's too late, Sarah. Sarah? Hello again, Lady Mira. Goodness, Mira. I didn't expect to see you back so soon. <laughs> Please excuse me. I missed. Ah, uh, okay, das war das erste Mal, dass das wirklich gar nicht so. Ich, ich meinte das wirklich überhaupt gar nicht so. Scheiße. 
schicke mir mal heimlich was zu trinken ein währenddessen. Oh oh. They haven't caught him yet. Not for lack of effort, mind you. I hear they've spared no expenses. Also, ich weiß ja darüber überhaupt gar nichts. Gucken wir uns mal die Aussicht an. Oh, it seems so calm out there. Sehr, es ist überall einfach nur schrecklich. Alles, was die Foresters gerade betrifft. Ah, oh, cool. Erstmal essen. Einfach mal hart gönnen hier. Wir dürfen zwar nicht hier sein, aber äh, wieso denn nicht? Und warum würdest du immer stop dealing Ironwood? Hm, ist da nicht mehr eine Demand? Ich kann nicht vorstellen, dass das der Fall wäre. No need for such wild speculation. I've simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. Hmm, and what would that be? <laughs> no, no, no. I can see what you're doing. I'm not giving away my secrets just yet. Oh, and Sarah, it's too much so light. Ich weiß gerade gar nicht, was ich jetzt machen muss. Yeah, hey, Lannister soll da haben. Hm, vielleicht sprechen. Lord Andros? Mira Forrester. Did you come to poke your nose in my business once again? Do you have a nasty habit of doing that? Hm. You're always so livid, Lord Andros. It can't be good for the Constitution. You think you can mock me? You have no idea what you're up against. Why don't you tell me then? You think you and your friend Morgren scare me? Who said Morgren was my friend? Don't play innocent with me. I know what he's planning. You can tell him that either you both stay out of my way, or I'll do much worse than drive him out of business. Good day, Lady Mera. Mera. Hmm, okay. <laughs> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Lady Mera, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? That you aren't currently locked in a cell. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How did you do it, if I may ask? I wasn't expecting mm. to see you again, if I'm being honest. You must have made quick work of it. Wir sagen mal nichts. All right. You can keep your secrets. I do believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me. I have a message from Lord Andros for you. And what would that be? He said he'd do much worse than drive you out of business. That insufferable! What did he mean by that? It seems Andros has already roped you into this mess. If you must know, I've been pushed out of the Ironwood business. Oh. All thanks to my partner, the bloody imbecile. Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive contact in King's Landing. No matter the fact that I introduced them in the first place. That man would be nothing without me. Do you know what Lord Andros is planning? He's acquired a large amount of gold, but I haven't the slightest idea what he intends to buy with it. Whatever it is, he's managed to get a Lannister involved. A Lannister? Hmm. Lyman. He may only be a third cousin, but he's a Lannister all the same. Ah, okay. <laughs> Rickard, are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. Oh, leave him alone. Please excuse me.
finde heraus, was Andros und Lyman planen. Jetzt kann ich ihn wieder belauschen. Warte mal, den belausche ich dann nochmal. Ob das das gleiche jetzt ist? Ich habe bereits gesagt, und wir haben nicht geeinigt, dass wir nicht mehr sprechen. All right, Ricard. How about something more personal then? Oh, you're calling me Ricard now. Well, when are you going to get married? <laughs> <laughs> Isla! <laughs> That took a turn, didn't it? You didn't answer the question. Er ist also nicht verheiratet. Und dann wieder ganz unauffällig setzen wir uns wieder hier hin. Uh, I thought we were done talking about this. You asked me about my friends. Friends, yes. Lyman is your business partner. What's the difference? Uh, fair enough, Andros. And if my friends happen to protect me from the crown, all the better. <laughs> I think I need more wine. Jetzt aber, jetzt aber. Guten Tag. Um, excuse me. Lyman Lannister? Ach. Shit. You startled me. As if I don't already have enough to deal with. Here, let me help. That's very kind of you. Thank you. But I'm fine. Gar kein typischer Lannister. I'm clumsy sometimes. I'm... I'm afraid you have me at a disadvantage, Lady... Mira. Lady Mira. I'm not used to being approached so boldly. But I'm glad you did. I always feel a bit out of place at big gatherings like this. So, what brings you over here? I'm not the best company, I'm afraid. Mm. Or were you headed for the wine and I got in your way? From what I hear, you're in the business of making rather important deals happen. Well, I don't know about that. Come on, don't be modest. I... I really shouldn't talk about it. Andros came to me in confidence. You understand. He wouldn't be pleased, I'm sure. You can trust me, Lord Lyman. I won't tell anyone. I... well... I suppose Lyman, I could just... What do you think you're doing? What? Nothing. You stay Miss... away from him. Andros! We were just talking. You were just talking to Mira Forrester. Forrester? Mist. I, I didn't realize. My lord? Let me say this as plainly as I can. Don't ever meddle in my affairs again! Oh, scheiße. Oh, nein! Lady Marjorie. Oh, Gott. Mist! Lady Marjorie. Boah, puh. Obwohl wir... Naja, man sieht doch an den Klamotten und... Naja, egal. Und sie versucht es weiterhin. Oh Gott. Lady Mira? That was quite a scene over there. Are you all right? I'm fine. I can handle Lord Andros. It's Lyman I was worried about. What do you mean? Honestly, that story isn't fit for a maiden's ears. Just be careful around him. All right? Just tell me, Lord Tarwick. It's important. I may be willing to tell you. If you'll first tell me something about Sarah. Uh-oh. Your help could save me a lot of embarrassment. Scheiße. I'd be very grateful, Lady Mira. Scheiße, scheiße. What do you want to know about Sarah? Sarah Durwell. Interesting name, that. Funny thing is, the last Durwells died off almost 200 years ago. Scheiße. What can you tell me about her family? Um, Something okay. isn't quite right. Okay, warte, warte, warte. But I'm not sure. You must understand... I can't court a woman just because I like the way she laughs. I've met the Durwells when I was at Highgarden. Oh? 
They're a small house these days, but Shit. very well regarded. Ah, right. Well, that's a relief. Oh, nicht die beste Beziehung auf der Lüge aufbauen, aber. And now, Lord Tarwick, it's your turn. Shit. Right, Lyman Lannister. Ten years ago, Lyman was injured at the tourney at Lannisport. He took a bad fall from his horse, needed milk of the poppy for weeks just to keep from screaming. Oh, milk from a puppy. And between us, he's never stopped drinking the stuff. Can't stop, actually. He spent all his money trying to get more. The man can't go a day without it. So that's why he shakes. You mustn't repeat that, Lady Mira. I shouldn't even know about it. Besides, Lyman suffered enough embarrassment. And every man's entitled to his secrets. I won't tell. I promise. Good. I'd hate for Lord Andros to trace this back to me. Boy, I have echt angst, dass das... that from Andros. The man's mouth is bigger than the black water. Poor Lyman has no idea. Hmm. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some arrangements to make. Ich hoffe, das klappt alles zwischen den beiden hier, obwohl ich. Kann sie nicht einfach heiraten, weil ich sie liebe? Hier ist sie peinlich, bro. Oh, 